Love it or hate it, Naruto is incredibly popular. It has been something that has been treasured for over decades now, and even despite obviously some people not liking Boruto, it's very clear that people hold Naruto at the very least very, very special within their heart. And with the recent news that's come out about Boruto with how it's going to be going on a hiatus slash indefinite hiatus, and it's just like comes as a shock for a lot of people, to also now having this news come out a few days later, it's just a lot's been going on within the Naruto community. So let's just, let's get right into this. The original Naruto anime is getting four new episodes to celebrate its 20th anniversary in September 2023. And I'm just gonna say, I really love this, like, key visual. I don't know if this is an official key visual or not, but legitimately, I love this picture. It looks really nice. I like getting to see, you know, the old school, original kid Naruto, and you get to see his, you know, Hokage self within, you know, his headband. It's just, this is a really nice little illustration. I, I'm a big fan. But... The reason why I want to talk about this is because when I was just looking at this, I'm like, oh, that's really good news. Like, I, it makes me excited because I'm excited to see whatever's going to be cooking up for four new episodes of Naruto. Probably they're going to maybe redo maybe some episodes or something in the past to celebrate it, maybe some key fights. Who knows? Because if anyone remembers, like, uh, you know, last year, there was a 20th anniversary special that came out that basically showcased, like, all the opening songs of Naruto, which... We all reacted to it. It was trending on YouTube. It was huge, absolutely huge in terms of, like, just the, the conversation around it. And the reason why I'm even mentioning that is because, obviously, this harbors some weight to that. Most likely, this, once again, could be a potential testing ground for the original Naruto, and maybe even one day remaking Naruto entirely with updated art and animation. Who knows? Because it's very clear by just how much effort was put into, like, that 20th anniversary last year that that's not just something that, you know, comes out of nowhere, so to speak. That That is definitely something that there was a lot of thought and planning. It could have been a teaser for potentially things to come. But let's scroll down a little bit. So upon this post, Mr. Beast himself even posted on this. And just to give a little bit of lore, I remember when the 20th anniversary came out. I remember Mr. Beast made a post on that po post as well when that, that PV came out. And said, how much would I need to pay to be able to get the entirety of Naruto remade. I mean, he made some like a post like that, and which is honestly just like whoa. It, it just goes to show once again, even Mr. Beast himself, people probably wouldn't expect he would be that big of a fan of Naruto, but clearly. He is, and it's just like, stuff like this really just goes to show that Naruto is very special to a lot of people, and it is special to me. I mean, I grew up with Naruto as well. I mean, I grew up alongside Naruto, Dragon Ball Z, I grew up alongside of Bleach in One Piece, but the first series I got into growing up was Dragon Ball Z and then Naruto. And I remember... Every day in 2006, 2007, 2008, etc., I remember literally, call me a nerd, dork, whatever, but I used to get like a, a bowl of ramen. Like, I would go down into my kitchen, I would make a bowl of ramen, I would put all this weird concoction together, I'd put soy sauce, I'd throw an egg in it, I'd chop up some onions, throw into it, all just for like top ramen, literally. And I would just, I'd get this, I'd boil the water, get it ready, and then I would sit down, grab myself, yes, a pair of chopsticks, and and watch the new episode of Naruto that aired. And I remember always just sitting at my desk. I was literally at my desk. And I would just be like this eating with my chopsticks. While I'm watching Naruto. And it's just like man. I was even going on to some jank sites as well. Yes I, I'm human. I did that too. And I, I even watched some episodes on YouTube in parts. I remember like sometimes people on YouTube would upload the episodes in parts. Like part 1, part 2, part 3. The old school people that you know have a watch YouTube for a very long time, definitely will probably remember that one, trying to scour the internet for, let's say, a new episode of an anime. But, um, all that aside, though, the point is, is that Naruto is obviously very special to a lot of people, including myself. And it's interesting that, um, with Boruto technically kind of being pushed to the side for now, for, you know, being put on hiatus... Now we have this news come out, and there's just a lot of conversation around Naruto. It's very clear that um, people just love the series. And it will always probably have a place in people's heart, regardless of how much time changes or whatever happens with Boruto, etc. But the point is, is that I hope that this is, like I said, a precursor to potentially a remake of the original Naruto. I would love to see that. If it's anything like what we got with, like, the, the 20th anniversary, you know, like, little trailer we got, 
I would love to see it. I would honestly love to see it. If, like, they put up a donation page for it, I would donate. Because, like, I would love to see some of the most iconic moments brought back to life in updated art and animation. It would be insane. But, um... Yeah, I just, I want to talk about this, because I just, I found it very fascinating, just the overall reaction. It's, like, a completely different, like, praise, or a different, I guess, community that is talking about Naruto right now. Because, once again, you go back a few days when the news of Boruto came out, with how the anime was just basically going on break, slash hiatus, whatever, people were like, okay, what matters? They're like, like, people like, we don't care, and all that type of stuff. People were memeing on Boruto. Truth. 100% truth. And so when you think about it like that, and then you see this, it's just like, wow, the 180 of the community, it just goes to show, once again, people don't care about Boruto. They only care about Naruto. But, I mean, we gotta remember the iconic meme. I wanna, I wanna dig up this old meme. Boruto's dad. <laughs> But okay, I, I, I want to leave it there, but uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, I just, I wanted to bring this to people's attention, because I know a lot of you out there, regardless of the memes of Boruto, do love Naruto. I mean, I reviewed the manga. I reviewed the anime for a while, so I do love this series. I know many of you part of the channel probably loves it too, so wanted to make sure everybody was up to speed with what's going on, etc. But with that, be safe, stay healthy, she be out.